Blondie Dread na the building. Blondie Dread na the building. Wag, wag, wag. Oh, what's up, people? What's good? What's good? What's hey good? Hey guys, it's, welcome back. It's, it's M P Seven. Hey guys, this is Key here. And this is Rush, the Jamaican in the building, guys. The Jamaican in the building, alongside the American right here in the building with me. Ah, uh, this is Key, and this is once again. And once Key, that's what would it be? What what? And this is Rush. You get me? Big up to all of y'all out there. What's good? What's good? I hope y'all staying safe and staying together. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. Uh, we're gonna do some reaction to um, out crazy um court outbursts and yes. sentencing. Yeah, guys. Top ten. Yep. Um, we've seen some crazy ones before, but we decided to show you guys our reaction to some of them. Yeah, man, there's some really crazy people out. Well, let me not say crazy people out there. People do some, some, some insane stuff to people out there, which I don't agree with. Where they get me, and then when you see them in the courtroom and and the family and emotions flare up and all that stuff, and somebody tell me just want to just grab that person and just give him a. I, 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 you want to do your own sentencing on them? Yeah, like like I would say, give my little jungle justice or you know, give my little Bart Simpson and Omar choke, you know, but he, he, he can't because Johnny Law there, there. You see me? And so my time, Johnny Law, I try stop you from getting your justice because you miss your loved ones and all that stuff. That's why I'm, that people just love each other, man, and don't do nothing stupid, man, please, because life is too short and too beautiful. For foolishness, man. Come I on. I know you believed in it so much. Ooh, so ah, much. whatever, man. But because some of the time, some of these people be doing some really crazy stuff, though. Like they don't. Even, I don't know if they don't think about stuff or it just happened. At the moment. Yeah, but 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 still, though, we all supposed to like even even that. Have even, some type of concept. Yes, you get me because jail is not pretty, man, and killing someone is not pretty either. And that I don't wish that I'm my worst enemy, yo. Just life is precious man it's pre you only get one go around at this bruh that's all we know about one go around all right i'm sorry for me just going on but he to my time so much passion like you you can do so much better with your life than than be behind bars though you get me mm -hmm. come on people think about stuff man come on there's this don't get me wrong there's certain times you gotta clap clap you get me but still <laughs> You gotta be, you gotta be smart about it, though. You know. All right, guys, let's get into it. Yeah, man. Straight, run the top ten now. So what kind of foolishness some people are going out with? And let us know, y'all. You know, just send us some videos that you would like for us to react. Yes. Yo. Thirty years. Wow. Thirty years though, bruh. It's a long time. That is a long time. Fourteen. He don't even look fourteen. What? Robbed, raped. Wait, wait a minute. You, you robbed, bruh. You robbed, raped. Those three are convicted with You robbed, raped. raped a 91 year old a 91 year old woman bro that's that's your like grand that's like your mama 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 bro like come on bro at 14 though bro come on 14 you don't even look 14. nah that that was like four years ago they said i guess now they send us in four years afterwards um, after the trial and all that i mean i guess after the juvenile and all that stuff they want to i guess do it when they were an adult i think he's like 18 now remember court cases don't you know get taken well, yeah, certain say, well, certain certain court cases don't take on immediately. You get me, but this one though, it, it, it sh yo, nah, bruh, nah, granny, no, 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 me ma, no, me ma, bruh, come on. Mm. Seventeen, see. Prosecutors wanted life in prison, but the Supreme Court ruling means minors can't receive the sentence. 
Rodriguez, who was also involved, made a plea deal and got her today over the murder of a high school student on prom day. 16-year-old Marin Sanchez was killed by a classmate because she wouldn't go to the dance with him. Mm, this is like a case of a bully. I mean, well, a geek or girl, a geek or a nerd or an outsider. Who you know asks a girl that he has a crush on to the dance? Yeah, so but he, he took the rejection pretty hard. Yeah, but there's so many other girls. As I said, there's so many other people out there. There's so many other things. Like if somebody say no, let's just move on though. He took a life of another young girl. Just for no girl, though. From a no that she said. It's not yo. I I know. I I've got no's in my life. You get me? Did you take the, take them hard? No, not like I want to go kill somebody for telling me no. I'm like, all right, cool. Brush my shoulders off and move on. It's a life. It's a life of a G, though. You know? Brush your shoulders off and move on. I'm not gonna go kill somebody life. And now, not, let's see how much years you. But I guess I'm gonna think how many years he's gonna get. Life. Well, he's still a minor, and this was taken in New York, so he might get life. Sentence is not enough. CBS 2 Scott Rappaport was in the Connecticut courtroom. Shh. Sentenced to 25 yeah. years for 25 years. 19 year old Christopher Plaskin uttered just five words in court. Thank you, Your Honor. Denurely declining the offer to speak about the heinous stabbing death of 16 year old classmate Marin Sanchez, whom authorities say he killed inside their high school on prom mm. day two years ago because she wouldn't go to the prom with him with savage fury. Mm. The ferocity of this attack and that it all occurred in the Are you gonna let him out back in 25 years? So it's gonna be about 50? In the courtroom, off camera, before the judge, the victim's mother, Donna no, forty-nine refused to discuss Plaskin, instead describing her daughter as the love of my life, my best friend. Mm -hmm. She was destined for greatness. Sad, later, sad, sad, sad. For the very first time, when I asked her what was in her heart. My feelings are is that Marin is in my soul. She walks with me every day. Mm -hmm. And, and she should carry her on it. He's a strong mother, mother. With her leading. Back in March, Plaskin pled no contest to the crime in exchange for the 25-year sentence. His lawyer said he was considering an insanity defense. Mm. You only got ill on one day. <laughs> really? Plaskin's family left court without comment. Under the terms of the sentencing, Plaskin could be eligible for parole in 13 years, having already served two years while waiting for trial. Mm -hmm. 22 year old Patrick Kemp faces murder <laughs> because his running. friend <laughs> died during the robbery. Police say he was involved in. I was in court when Kemp heard the charges he faces. He frowned up at some of the allegations and even had a smirk on his face at times that didn't sit well. But the homeowner who frowned his friend wounded in his driveway. He had a look on his face, but he didn't care. That's what Archie mm -hmm. Booker thought when he saw 22-year-old Patrick Kemp smirking when he went before a judge on murder charges. Kemp why, also Pookie, why? Why, Pookie, why? The allegations. The homeowner identified as Michael Richards did shoot Williams as he began entering the window. Kemp faces murder charges after Riverdale police say this homeowner shot and killed 19-year-old John Dexter Williams on Birch Circle Tuesday before noon. In court, the judge explained that Williams and Kemp went to the home with a plan to break into it. He says you did knock on the front door at the location while the co-perpetrator, John Williams, did break through a window in the rear of the location. That's mm -hmm. when the homeowner shot Williams. Kemp was apprehended later. After Williams was shot, he collapsed in Archie Booker's driveway. Booker was so shaken by what happened, he posted this on Facebook. To my young black brothers, you know, it's not worth it. It's just I know. breaking sure. in folks' homes because people are not going to stand for that. A teenage killer officially sentenced to death. A judge agreed with the Warren County jury, which sentenced 19-year-old Austin Myers to death. He is now the youngest person on death row in Ohio. Not on your side, Jay Warren was there as a mother pleaded for her son's life. Austin Meyer showed no emotion as the Austin death sentence Meyer. was imposed. In fact, he showed no emotion Oscar throughout Meyer the Wiener? entire course of the trial. <laughs> Today, in a last-ditch effort, Austin Meyer stood up oh, and asked Austin Meyer, to excuse spare me. his life. I think there's a lot of good things I can do with my life. Did you spare the other person's life? No. 
Myers and his co-defendant Timothy Mosley killed 18-year-old Justin Back during a robbery attempt at his home in Waynesville. Mm. Today, the judge imposed the jury's recommendation of death. The court finds that the state has proven beyond the okay, reasonable well, doubt that does the death penalty. penalty factor. Therefore, the sentence of death shall be imposed upon Austin Gregory Myers on the charge of aggravated murder. Myers once again showed no emotion. Out of touch with reality, that's how prosecutor David Fornshell describes it. During the trial, he actually had a conversation, a jail call with his dad, where he agreed that his plea agreement would be that if we dismissed all charges against him, <laughs> that he wouldn't sue me for wrongful imprisonment. Wow. apologized in court today and asked that her life be spared. Have you ever heard that? The, the, um, what's it called? The defendant or the... These are the these are the, the the defendant. Have you ever heard of that a defendant asking to drop all charges so they could go get off scot free, so he won't sue the what the, the state, yeah, or the attorney general for um wrong for imprisonment. imprisonment. I don't know, man. People do people say some crazy stuff, man. But just to get out of it, though. Yeah, but you get yourself into it. It's not worth it, as the guy said before. It's not worth it, man. Hmm. <laughs> That's when a prosecutor let her have it. I know it's, it's not an easy thing, but I want you to know that you are not so Among the first words the public has heard from Margaret Allen through her tears is that she's sorry for the murder of Wenda Wright. The judge will consider the testimony in deciding whether to follow the jury's recommendation of death for Allen. The victim's common-law husband and relatives watched it all, and when it came time for the husband to speak, he looked Allen straight in the eye. I'm angry about it, yes. but uh, I forgive you. Allen will be sentenced to... What is that, bro? Forgive you? That was a no, I forgive you. Not with your brows looking like this. Yo, no, no. <laughs> I forgive you. He's like, hell no, you better lock her up and don't let her out. <laughs> Yo, you throw like, have, bleach? Have you ever gotten upset with someone that you <laughs> accuse of them stealing from you? Would you go that far? It's not worth it. No. It's pouring bleach and taping them up. And call the cops. Them? Call the cops. Call the if cops. If you feel like, basically, she should have called call the cops. cops. If you if she, if she had called the cops, she wouldn't have been a she wouldn't have been where she is right now. Talking about I'm a kind person. If you was a kind person, you would have thought the story like miss call the cops. Or even look. Or even like look. Your housekeeper was basically stealing, stealing from, from you. you. That's it. <sighs> and then you have your daughter there to the see the whole thing. You get to see two very different faces of this car thief. On the left, Ryan Stone bragging about his crimes to a female visitor in jail. And on the right, Stone crying in court as he learned he will spend the rest of his life locked Ooh. up. Yo, when they got you, they got you. The from Longmont to Parker. Mm. Today, we learn much more about this dramatic case. And Denver 7 reporter Mark Stewart joins us now with more oh, on this going to run, run in the snow. Very, didn't seem very remorseful before today. Indeed, and in fact, you could argue the man behind the wheel here was money hungry. Just released recordings reveal he wanted to profit from all of the clicks of the chase received on our own Denver 7 YouTube channel. Mm. A high speed chase through five Metro Denver cars. He was on the opposite times, side, too. Cars were ditched and drivers thrown out. Mm. All right, Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, GTA. GTA. Auto. There you go. <laughs> you got recorded. For the first time since last year's chase, we are seeing a This was in 2011. Wow. Driver Ryan Stone hoped to profit from his internet fame. After the video was posted online, paid by YouTube. Really? So, uh, News, I believe, is going to be the one that gets paid for that. Well, um, I'm going to contact News. During this they, in court, buddy, they're recording your whole conversation. Like, how can you be <sighs> that dumb? Like, seriously, how can you be that dumb? No, 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 he's not dumb. He's very smart. But he's no, he's very smart. He's very, very smart. He's very, very smart. Okay. I give it up to him. You're definitely the Einstein. Made an apology, yet wouldn't take responsibility, blaming his escapade <laughs> <for> drugs. <laughs> he asked the judge <laughs> to give him <laughs> a break. Give him a break. A break. That's what he said. 
with my beautiful wife. That didn't happen. Stone was sentenced to 160 years in Ooh, prison. Those that's life, baby. Angels of Hundred us. Me out of the way. Trooper Bell mm. he almost died. We out, 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 we out. He did a basic Grand Theft Auto. Yo, you, yo, you were playing too many GTA, bro. Too many hours on GTA, bro. It's not worth it, bro. Played only on the game. It's very uncivilized. <laughs> He's an animal. It's very uncivilized. John Sanchez is the father christy sanchez she was one of the four murder wow all right now oh okay at 43 year old jacob rodovich and ordering valencia williams to kill Haley navarro her family is still distraught over those circumstances wow. sorry man night security everyone in the gallery had to go through metal detectors to <laughs> make sure nobody mm -hmm. had to stop nobody between the victim's family members and rackham's family the convicted killer's friends like somebody about to fight up in the courtroom yo look at that dude though Whew. he got a, a bar you know a barcode up there about the life scan about the life 099 well zero 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 it's about the life mm. dumb dumb and it's dumb. covering for someone else if you ain't got your word and you're not loyal and you're a rat or two-faced or kind of iffy you don't make it out here you don't have that chance he never stood a chance against it and he's never coming home the judge is recommending that Rackman serve his sentence in the Wabash Valley Correctional Facility. Mm. And right now at 530, he was a day filled with outbursts inside a Broward County courtroom. The man found guilty of a deadly shooting inside a Dunkin' Donuts took the stand. His name is James Harari. He's a former and a Dunkin' member. Donuts. Why, man? Just get two donuts and a cup of coffee and be out, man. Don't you know how cops always be at Dunkin' Donuts, man? Like, early, I'm coming home. I saw, like, six cops coming out of Dunkin' Donuts. Big up to the cops, though. <laughs> well, during James Harrard's trial, he never got the chance to testify. So today was his day to state his case in front of the judge before the judge hands down his sentence. And you would be surprised to hear what Harrard had to say. <laughs> in what is supposed to be convicted killer James Harrard's last chance to escape the jury's recommendation of a death sentence, Harrard took to the stand be able to get him. and said this. I'm not asking this period. Sounds bizarre. Listen to the reason why. Because I know the Supreme Court, you know I mean, won't allow me to die for something that I didn't commit. Well, Harrard didn't pull the trigger in the 2008 murder of 39-year-old Eric Jean-Pierre, who was gunned down. A testimony brought Harrard's mom to tears, overwhelmed with what her son now faces. Harrard was one of several gang Dang. members involved in a string of violent Dunkin' Donuts robberies. Mm. Wait, it was a string. So it, it wasn't, wasn't only just one. one. It was a string. <laughs> they was like, we're going to hit up all these Dunkin' Donuts. All of them. Don't you know cops always be there, bro? Like, really? I don't know about Fort Lauderdale. I guess not, because it was a string. Many of the horrific crimes caught on camera. A jury convicted Harrar for the brutal murder of a Dunkin' Donuts customer back in 2008. Mm. He received multiple counts of life imprisonment for that crime. And multiple offenses. counts of now, life. The jury that convicted him says he deserves to die. Now, it's up to the judge. Mm. Go ahead and do what you're going to do. Pretty much, you know what I mean? Pretty, pretty much, I'm pretty much daring you to give me the okay. distance. Pretty much. Oh, okay. That hurt a child on purpose, and not just one child, but several. That's what parents of some tiny victims told a judge today, asking for a long sentence for Alexis Sexton for the pain she caused their families. Robert Gann says his 14-month-old grandson, Noah Philhauer, will never be able to heal from the injuries he received when he was intentionally dropped by 19-year-old wow. Alexis Sexton. Get Sexton. Get Sexton. That's what she said? Sexton. Um, he had three broken ribs. Gans now has custody of And I do ask that she gets punished and that justice is served for the children who don't have a voice. I would like to apologize to all my victims. She I don't care. mean it. She don't, she don't mean it. She, she don't. She, you like, the way that she looked back was like. She like, whatever. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I should have did more. That's what, she, that's what you were saying. Me. Like you bad, bad she, orange, bad. I felt like she was messed up as a child, and she was like, "Let me just take out my frustration on these little ones, cause you bad. They ain't got like they said, they got little, no voice. They have no voice. 
You bad though. Only way we they know That's they have cruel. a voice is when the child when you get you see a child and they on get camera. on uh, camera or you see them with bruises and stuff. You ask the person like, like, hey, what? Why my son or daughter has this big old bruise? <laughs> I'm done. Yeah, I would have jumped over and just choked her. Give her two of these quick yeah, fast. Yeah, they would have put you in uh, in jail for that. Oh yeah. I, I'll be jail with her. Yeah, I'll be with jail with her. <clears throat> I wish them nothing but the best in the future. Wish them nothing but the best in the future. At her sentencing, Sexton spoke oh, to her. She, she, she has a serious problem she can't control. And her mom, Jackie Yoakum, agreed. She asked the judge for mercy for her daughter because she's suffering too. She um, also admitted to me that. She never told me this because she thought people would turn against her and think she was crazy. She is crazy. Well, several other family and friends spoke on Sexton's behalf, but in the end, the judge says because of the children she hurt and the seriousness of the crimes she committed, she had to go to prison. Why, well, she wasn't going to go to prison? This day for a long time. These charges come from the fact that actually happened War machine. War right. machine! What war machine day? I, I, I didn't know it was about Avengers life. The not Avengers life. <laughs> what did War Machine did to get <laughs> sentenced for life? <sighs> but even with today's sentencing, Max says that she'll always live with a certain amount of fear. But you know, when, when I get out, when he gets out, he will kill me. War Machine was facing That's War Machine? Yeah, charges. it's he War was Machine. Guilty on 29 of those, all in connection to the attack on his ex-girlfriend and the man she was dating at the time, Corey Thomas. From the testimony, this was a brutal attack. The ER doctor who treated Mac said that she had a broken nose, mm. fractured a rib, broken mm. facial bones, and mm. lost teeth. He went on to say her liver was so damaged mm. you could compare it to someone who had been in a car crash. Mm. Today, War Machine told the judge that he's been thinking about everything that's happened and he hates himself for it. I should have killed myself right now. Got the grenades in the neck, got the grenades in the neck, got the grenades in the neck. Okay. That's why it's war machine. Explosive. <laughs> so that was it. Those, some of them cases was like... Horrendous and it was unimaginable. A, it, it was a sad because most of those cases was all for young people. You get me? Young people who don't even start out in life yet who haven't really. They're just at the tip of life though. And they just got snubbed out who they killed. Right. And not to mention who's. So right. And who's not to mention who's getting life imprisonment or 30 plus years or, 50, or 100 and triple toss. Like, like the one that did the Grand Theft Auto. Like, come on, bro. All for the likes. Is, was it worth it? I guarantee you, you're sitting right now knowing in yourself that was not worth it at all. Not for the likes, man. Not like that. Not like that, man. Most definitely not. Like the court case um, with the babysitter, she knew she had a problem. Like, why are you babysitting, man? Why? Are you, like, if you knew you had a problem, why didn't you just go seek help? Stop babysitting and in, uh, total, in general, in general, no. stop babysitting. One time, done it. And just go and seek help. You told your mom that you have a problem. No, it's just you just told her mom, I guess, because she got locked up. Uh -oh. Now she got a problem. Like really, you know, you always had a problem. You already know you had a problem. After you, you there breaking. You, you I break wonder how many small little babies. I wonder how many kids you have actually. They earned. have weak bones. They, their bones are not strong. I wonder how many kids you have actually hurt before they actually got because there's only two they, they that, actually said yeah that issue came up that was she was babysitting mm -hmm. it's that sad. was sad that was sad but I didn't feel when she was saying she was sorry the way she looked back was not she She's was like, eh. not sincere about that sincere she didn't I don't think she had a sincere bone in her body no most definitely not um but what was another one that that got to me? Um, the prom date. That one was another court case that was like. 
I think he deserved. I think he deserved more time than that for, for the really life do. of that person that he years, killed. That's it. With a possibility of a parole, parole for doing good because he already did in with te- two. Yes, in thirteen years, right? But he did two, so he could possibly be out. By eleven years from now. Yeah. That's messed up, though. You get me, really and truly, because that and person. His attorneys was trying to tell him to plead a insan- plead insanity, and he was like, nah. Yeah, because you know you you kill somebody and that person will never be back, and you and it's just sad, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the family that they that lost their loved one. Because as I said, I don't wish death upon my worst enemy. Because losing a loved one, losing a friend, it's not easy. You get me? Because you miss that person, you can never talk to that person, you can never hear that person, you can never hug that person, you can never be there. You know, matter of fact, you you can do all those stuff, but you can't. The person's not talking back to you. You understand? Yeah, it's true. So, what I what I liked about was the mother of the slain teenager that she she had her held up her head held high and she says my daughter is with me every day through my spirit and soul I mean mm-hmm. body and soul she's mm-hmm. walking with me every day mm-hmm. so she basically is you know taking she's kind of some at somewhat peace with at it peace with I don't think she's fully at peace with it but. She she she's strong though. Yeah, she you get me? definitely she is strong. I like that. But yeah, that was it for you. That's it for me for now. Until right, the next guys. video. Alright, guys. So the next video, uh, we're gonna see some outrageous and funny court cases yes. from Judge Joe Brown. Would, would you like to see Judge Joe Brown or would you like to see Judge Judy? Because some of their court cases be really hilarious. Or we can even see Providence that too yeah we can see providence because he, he's one of them i'll I be i'll be be watching you sir <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> all right guys we're going to end this video here please remember to like subscribe and comment down below and please hit that notification bell so you can stay up to date with our latest and greatest videos and comments and our reactions on our movements 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 yes most definitely please also remember we have another channel it's called key and rush where we do other types of reactions like music, mukbangs, and travel. Well, travel yes. is on hold right now because yes. we're in quarantine. But once we are able to travel again, we'll we'll pick that back. Yes, right back most up. definitely because we do, we do like to travel, and I love to see the world. You get me? As I said, the world is beautiful, and I like to and I want to see more of the world. You get me? I we going to see. I'm <laughs> sorry, not I, because I'm that I sound very selfish. We going to see. You Most see definitely. me? Big up to Real Wea, big up to all of my sevens, big up to all of our fans. You yeah. get me? Big up to yourself for watching us. You see me? Because we like that you're watching and we, we appreciate it. Most you definitely. See me? Big up to my partner right here in crime, Key. Bang, 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 bang. Big up to Fire Furnace. Most definitely. We hear some music from your youth and we appreciate Well, oh, dogs, the music tough. You see me? So. Listen off for the music and yes, then gonna drop some. The one that he released a few days ago. Yeah man, new Real new Friends. new new music, my yo. We te- yo, we've been asking for it and we finally got the new music dogs. You see me? Real friends, you see me, real way. You see me? Real way we say. Real way entertainment, one time. Fire furnace, run on, fire <laughs> range, big up, you see me? Please remember to tell a friend. To make a friend. To keep a friend. So we all can, can be, be friends. friends. Yes, yeah, Zimmy. Prior range. Now say our word, dogs. Bye.